Uh, y'all heard about Jason Lee uh, calling Jennifer Hudson illiterate. I know y'all saw that at the uh, beginning of the week. It was like real messy and catty. <laughs> Who is J- Jason Lee? Jason, Jason Lee is, is that a, gay. Yeah. I know him from off the, he, yeah. I know yeah. from he off the breakfast club. Jason Lee does that. Yeah. He's, from, he's from Love Well, he's like, uh, he, that's like what him. he does. I don't like You know him. what I'm saying? What I think it, he's um, funny personally. I'm not going to lie. I, I, I think like he's funny. Yeah, I like Jason Lee. I, I and funny, like so. Well, he called Jennifer Hudson illiterate because Jennifer Hudson got the scoop with Jeannie May on their divorce. So... She he got pissed and called uh, Jennifer Hudson illiterate, and then all these black women got mad at him and called him out and said, "Why are you even speaking on black women?" And blah 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 blah. Well, because I blame black women, period, for empowering this nigga because that's what they did. What happened, Jason Lee? Oh, oh yeah. Like, oh shit! If he know what the hell he's talking about, shit. Another another person that's and tell me the T Jason Lee. I want to know the T Jason Lee. I put him in. I put him in the academics category. No, I put him in the saucy Santana category. I just like. I just think certain people are stars. That, <laughs> I'm not really too. <laughs> wow. I'm, not, I'm not really too fond of like that. Like I'm not either. But like I said, what it is 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 black women empower these gay men and bring them into their safe spaces and then get upset when they when don't they agree say with something them. that goes against what they said. Yeah. So I mean, I look at black women that fall for this because y'all are the ones who empower niggas like these and make them comfortable enough to say shit like that. I mean. <sighs> Yeah. 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 You flush. Cause, cause black women be having safe spaces and the first thing they do is like gay niggas and, and, and trans niggas all up in their spaces and then get mad when they don't agree with them. I can't say that that happens. That that, that happens quite frequently. But I ain't got nothing to do with that. I don't know about that. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. Like, <laughs> I, I see it all the time. It's like when gay niggas is ready to be be women's mules and do their hair and makeup, they cool. When they're ready to rape academics on their uh, black women's behalf, they cool. The minute they say some shit they don't like, they turn on them. I mean, everybody mm. has an opinion. You know what I'm saying? And but, being... Well, it, it's oh. the re, it's the response. It's is that like, a tap, tap, tap? Is that a you, tap? You let these motherfuckers into your safe space. See, he dances, so I know who that is. It's the weed man. No. Oh. Oh. Uh, okay. Well, yeah, what I was saying is y'all let these these niggas up in your safe space knowing that oh, they could say that. some sideways shit. Cause that's you something have to call the girl slow. Yeah, but that's something I men mean, don't have to worry about. And based off of what you just said, <laughs> y'all know I don't care what I say. They be ready to counsel me every week, so I don't care. Yeah. But I mean, Jason Lee is one of the girls. Yeah. So that's, it's like what I'm saying it's really like a caddy argument. So okay. And then Fantasia was hit. You know, she had the same thing when she what? came out. Fantasia was illiterate. Literate, yeah. yeah. So you so saying I don't her? Think, I don't think she. Yeah, Fantasia couldn't well, read or write. I, mean, I don't think. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, there's I'm not saying they don't have. Rate. I don't. I, now I know because with this generation coming up, I'm not saying nobody don't need no education or don't need know how to read and write. But I mean, like they sing, they right. have great voices. Do you really? You're not looking for them to give the presidential debate so, or a speech. So you don't. You getting them to? You know. expecting them to get up there to open it up, singing the Star Spangled Banner? They ain't gotta like read to it. They can it. listen to it again. Right. I'd like to see a spelling bee between Jennifer Hudson and Fantasia. Oh, wow, man. Like, you know. See, no. that, that's something you would like to see. Nah, but see, the thing is, like, <laughs> it, to put to put women down. Now, if you want to do a one. versus, but. That see, is now, a verse. That, that's that, a yeah, verse for your ass. spelling bee, come yeah. on. Who, who your money on in a versus with Jay Hudd and Fantasia? They both go holler the whole time. So who your money yeah, on, though? Who you, who what, you in going to in a versus with Jay Hudd They're going to have a hollering Fantasia. competition. Who I get a headache throughout the first five minutes of this. I don't think I will. I don't know. Oh, you ain't gonna go with Fantasia because she the NC problem. I mean, I'm, like, I said both we, of them holler. Cause Jay Cole take any like we put Jay Cole against anybody. And then one and gonna holler louder than Cole. the other one to get they point across in the song. So they just gonna be hollering. Ha, 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 ha. Yeah. <laughs> I don't wanna hear that shit for an hour. 